All right, so we uh, just rebooted. Uh, we got it uh, unplugged from everything. Uh, we still have it hooked up to the Ethernet though. So I'm going to uh, quickly set up a user. Uh, right now, all we have is the root user and password. And what we're going to do is add user, put the name in, enter a few times, enter the name, password, and clear that out, get it up top. We're going to uh, edit the sudoers so that uh, that user has the rights to uh, change everything, which I'm, sh I'm assuming you want. You go down and find this root and MS, uh, enter the username and copy the all, uh, all everything like that up here. Make it make it the same thing with the username in front of it. Control X Y, clear it out. And so now uh, exit out, and you should be able to enter the yep enter the uh, super user with the new username. And what I usually do now, uh, we can set up. Um, Let's do the uh, the mirrors first. So we change directories to uh, etc pacman dot d ls. We find our mirror list. We copy mirror list. Uh, anytime you have uh, the only option in here is mirror list, you just type an m. You tab it over, and it'll auto complete. And we want to make another one mirror list dot backup ls lists what's in that file. Now we have a backup. Uh, we can look at it, and we see it's the same thing we had before with uh, Canada and the U.S. Uh, exit out, clear. We can do rank mirrors. Oh, sorry, we need to set up the uh, network, so let's do DHCPCD, ETH0, because you have that dongle. It's going to go through the steps. <clears throat> And it shows it looks like it's good. IF config, and we have a mask, uh, all this type of stuff means we're probably good. Clear it out. I can type. And now we can do rank mirrors. And we do in, I use eight. No, let's just go to six. That's what it says to do. And we're going to mirror list dot backup greater than mirror list. We wait a couple of minutes, or hopefully less than a minute. We'll see. I've been having issues with some bad header links coming up at this stage. Let's see if it uh, doesn't happen this time. Yep, there's those bad header links. I don't know why it's doing that. If somebody could point that out. That would be awesome. Should just take a second. Clear it out. Gotta learn how to type. And we can do an LS, we can do a nano mirror list, and we see it's generated mirror list to pick the fastest six. Clear it out. <clears throat> now let's do a Pac-Man SYY to sync with those with the new mirror list. Uh, let's do a Pac-Man SY Yaurt. This will give you access to the Arch user repository. And we do want to install it. And that's going to give you Yaurt also. So you can see these are the packages you can install. Pretty much every piece of software you can imagine is going to be on there. That's uh, very, very useful. Even the officially listed stuff's in here. You get to see how many people installed things, so you can pick the, the most popular, knowing that they're probably pretty good. Use it all the time. All right, so now let's do a full system upgrade if there's anything out there. And I believe I have a, um, yeah, I have a kernel upgrade. 
right here, uh, Linux 2.13-1. So I'm going to go ahead and hit yes and come back after a reboot. Okay, so we just had our uh, upgrade, kernel upgrade and reboot. And so we're going to go into super user and we're going to first uh, set up our wireless. So we're going to go Pacman. Yes, I like to use Wicked. So we're going to win. Oh, sorry, I got to do the. Uh, um, got to do the. Uh, there we go. You might have to set up your uh, Ethernet again. Uh, so. Now that we have Wicked installed, if you go to the uh, Arch or Arch um, Wiki and you do uh, search for Wicked, uh, you install the Wicked package, and then uh, the initial setup you need to do um, rc.d stop network and rc.d stop D H D H C P C D. It's not a not executable. Do it again for net work manager, which I don't think is on. No. So now we do uh, nano etc rc dot conf, and we go to the bottom to the daemons. We're going to comment out using exclamation point the network. We don't want the network to control this. We want WICT to. Enter it there. Control I, uh, control Y exit, enter, control Y, control X, Y enter. And uh, go back up to the top. And Dbus isn't in there yet. We haven't installed it. Uh, then we want to start. We haven't installed Dbus yet, but uh, we're, we're going to go ahead and tell it to start. Um, and then the next one we do is rc.d start wicked. These are the daemons, so rc.d start wicked. And there we go. Uh, I don't know why it's doing that, but I think I usually just control C out of that. And what you want to do is run uh, wicked dash curses. This is kind of a GUI here. Uh, you find the network you want, right arrow, uh, connect automatically, and then enter your key if you have one, and then F10 to enter, and then what you get here, control C to connect, and validating, authenticating, obtaining IP address, connected. So I think at this point you're ready to go. It turns green. Shift Q to quit. Clear it out to clear it. I'm going to disconnect the dongle. No network anymore or no Ethernet at least. So let's just do a quick Pac-Man SYU and we are officially on a wireless network and so I'm going to break that right there and come back and do sound. Alright, the, uh, the main uh, program I use for the back-end configuration, I just use Pulse Audio, so Pac-Man S and we're going to do, uh, if you limit typing this will include Pulse Audio um, Pulse Audio also, lib32, lib pulse, lib32, also plugins, and again, I just went to, uh, just went to pulse audio on the uh, wiki page. Uh, okay, and I'm going to go ahead and for later on, you're going to want this, Pavu control. So when you're dealing with things like um, like uh, Skype, that Pavu control gives you a GUI there that you can actually tweak it on the uh, the GUIs later on. And we're going to 
and go ahead and install that. Shouldn't take too long. And while we're working on that, the next thing we're going to work on is uh, if you go to the beginner guide and you go to sound, you go to this, um, yeah, you go to sound and you have this advanced Linux sound architecture. And you go down to uh, the also mixer, that's what we want to get to. So we're going to have to install uh, also utils, also plugins, and those will also get you plugins into your applications later on. So while wow, that's updating. Almost there. Okay, clear it out. Now we want to do Pac-Man S yes. also utils also plugins. Alright, clear it out, and we want to do also mixer. Alright, so here's your uh, here's your interface for also mixer. We want to select our sound card, and this is a little tricky on the MacBook. You need to hold down the the uh, Alt and hit F6, and we want to select your sound card. In my case, it's Nvidia. Same thing. We hit Alt F5 to show all. Now you see these little M's, uh, masters all the way up, so I'm going to turn that down so it doesn't blow the speakers out. You go to headphones, right, left arrow, right arrow. The MM means it's muted, so you need to hit M again, M again, headphones. Put it there, front speaker all the way up and let your master control it. M for your surround, and then up arrow to let your master control it. Mic, uh, sometimes if you overdo it, then it'll distort. Just keep hitting M. I unmute everything and your capture you need to make sure is not zero or else you won't be able to talk in your Skype and things like that or your, in your screen caps. Okay, when you're done hit escape and we do also ctl space store and that should set it up. So let's do a speaker test. Dash C two, oh, let's do four. And that sound means you now have sound. So I'm going to uh, break it here and come back and do X.